Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And our live game is Barcelona against Real Madrid. This is Peter Drury, and next to me, providing insights, will be Jim Begley. Well, thanks for that, Peter. I'm uh, more than ready to get going here. Well, you can feel the sense of occasion here. El Clasico, one of world football's great occasions. No rivalry more intense. Barcelona goes for this lineup. Bravo keeps goal. Pique, Mascherano, Daniel Alves, Jordi Alba, Sergio Busquets, Rakitic, Iniesta, Messi, Neymar, Luis Suarez, tasked with leading the line. Real Madrid play away from home. Casillas takes the gloves. Pepe, Sergio Ramos. Daniel Carvajal, Marcelo, Tony Kroos, Modric, James Rodriguez, Bale, Cristiano Ronaldo, Benzema, tasked with scoring goals. So it's away we go then. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Well, it's not hard to like what Sergio Ramos offers. Um, goes about his work with strong aggression and tries to dominate opposition strikers. He's also a sizable menace on set pieces and brave at getting his head on the ball. Yeah, the scourge of so many strikers. Benzema has a goal! Jordi Alba. Well down the left. Now, what are his options? Jordi Alba. Fired in. James Rodriguez. Bale. James Rodriguez. James Rodriguez! And that's caused the worry or two. Well, with this guy and the talent he's got, you know he's probably going to try his look from there, but that one he didn't really get right at all. Oh, look, they've started with such intensity, but maybe they just need to add a little composure to their finishing. You know, it's the only thing that's missing so far. James Rodriguez. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Rakitic. Conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Now it's Luis Suarez. Now it's Neymar. A chance! Neymar with a shot! It's anyone's ball. Neymar. Decides to play it back. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Daniel Carvajal boots it to safety. Very well to intervene. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? It's gone for a throw in. Another throw in. Now it's Benzema. Benzema with the ball through. Well played. He saw that coming. has beaten it away. Can he finish? Decent enough try. Well, when it becomes that speculative, I think it requires something from the very top drawer, and he had to think a little bit more about that. In the end, he's just opted for raw power. Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Well, when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close.
plenty of endeavour from either side, but not much of it in the vicinity of either goal. Just a bit short on adventure. It's well blocked, and back out it comes. Now it's Neymar. Rakitic looks to slip it through, and he's cut it out. Marcelo gets it away. Neymar. Jordi Alba. Sergio Ramos gets good distance on it. Rakitic. Oh, good ball. Luis Suarez looking to force his way through. Goal! Barcelona! Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Barcelona give themselves the perfect start. Can they build on it? So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Modric. And he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Forward it goes. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And it's Bale. Lovely feet. A wonderful effort all by himself. Well, he knew he needed a better angle to get a shot away, and I suppose at least he showed the best option, it just didn't come off. Smart save. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Yes, it's in! Unbelievable. Well, we're all back to square one, but I hope this game opens up from here. It looks as if it could happen. Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. It's almost a case of, of sacrificing some of the power in favour of getting the technique right. And technically, that volley was as good as it comes. That's not an easy skill, we know that by now. That's fantastic. That has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, in a game like this, every chance is vital, but they're back on level terms. Messi. There's a look up from the right-hand side, seeking out options. And the finish! Luis Suarez. Tries a through ball. It's a loose ball. And he's there to hoof it away. Jordi Alba. Now it's Luis Suarez. James Rodriguez. Hoops it upfield. Long and high towards the flank. Out towards the flank. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! This could fall anywhere. Bravo, 
Reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Well, they say all goalkeepers are crazy, and after that, maybe there's some truth in it. Real Madrid get themselves into the lead. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Messi. Now the pass. Rakitic. <laughs> Lovely bit of skill. They've won a corner. Keeper's ball. Tony Cruz. Iniesta passes it through. Dispatch clinically. Barcelona are back in business. Yeah, I love the finish, but I think had the pass been delayed for just a second longer, I think he would have been flagged offside. And I think you have to praise them all round on that one from the pass and the finish. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. Quite a thriller this one's become. Oh, I think the coach will really be in. And we hit half time. Quite a half. More of the same, please. Score at the interval 2 2. Real Madrid, the second half started. Modric, Daniel Carvajal, Bale. Has gone out. Messi. Lobs it in gently. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Luis Suarez, that is wayward. Well, that's the kind of break that can do a lot of damage. It just lacked the finish to be a great counter-attacking strike. It was so direct. They're committing a lot of men forward at the start of this second half. They know that this is an important time for them now. That's not going to make it. Sergio Busquets. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. And it's James Rodriguez. Barcelona got lucky. They have escaped lightly. Luis Suarez. Oh, defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Cristiano Ronaldo. Real Madrid going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Modric. Modric has been caught there, it's a foul. And Pepe. Forward, what does he try from here? Looks like a good ball through. Referee's had a good look and given a corner. Neymar! He will be livid with himself.
James Rodriguez. Cristiano Ronaldo. Thrust towards the front line. Messi with the ball through. Looks to slip it through. He's made sure that that won't get through. Bale. Real Madrid keep the ball but can't do anything meaningful with it. Barcelona haven't made a substitution yet. Cristiano Ronaldo. And the break is on. Luis Suarez. Modric. James Rodriguez. Now it's Benzema. It's Benzema! A oh, great save, real class. And that wasn't exactly a routine save. He still had an awful lot to do to keep that out. Superb. It so nearly came off for him. I think what we're looking at here is just a very special talent. Someone who can decide the outcome of a match on his own. Where to from here? And it's Iniesta. Jordi Alba. Pique. Rakitic. Spoon forward. Now it's Luis Suarez. Looking to get within range. Now it's Bale. Benzema. Well, you could just about hear the collective sigh there. They know they got away with one. Iniesta. Neymar. A glorious footwork. He would surely have scored there more times than not. Cristiano Ronaldo. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. And it's Bale. Bale. Still anyone's game this. One moment can decide it. Yes, and what a battle this has been. Neither is showing any sign of backing off. It's a tribute to wonderful attitude to put everything they've got into attempting to gain that vital edge. Tries a through ball. Luis Suarez has been given offside. Pepe, Tony Kroos, Messi, now the pass, well positioned to make that interception, he has crossed the line and it's a throw. Well for me this was the obvious substitution, he'd become just a little jaded and as a result of that he was most likely to make a mistake, I think sometimes when the body becomes tired the brain goes with it and I think that's happened in this case. A oh, great ball! Barcelona don't have many options and time is running out. Modric tries the route one option. And it's Messi. Cristiano Ronaldo. And the counter is on. Sergio Busquets. They really need to start moving the ball forward with pace at this late stage of the game. Modric. Locks it towards the front. A real chance to break. Chance! Oh, he's found him in space! It's in! And you can't but admire that from a player from whom we expect to come to the fore at crucial, crucial moments. Doing it, however, is another matter, and his influence just grows and grows. And time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Cristiano Ronaldo is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them.
Real Madrid take what looks to be a decisive lead. Messi. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Barcelona are stunned. They controlled it, they led, but somehow they lost. Thoughts on what we've just seen? Yeah, defeat in, in any of these type of games is, is the ultimate disappointment. You can't fault the effort, the endeavour we saw, but they probably just lacked a, a little adventure and not enough ambition in their play, and ultimately I think they paid the price.